Socialism used to mean the ownership and operation of the means of production. Nobody gives it that meaning today. There is no country in the world today that, that really tries to be socialist in that sense, except for North Korea. And maybe right now, Russia is moving in that direction. But that's about it. Opinion has not shifted far enough in terms of the dangers of a big government and the effect it can have. And that's where we're facing problems for the future. Sooner or later, government will want to uh, raise money without imposing taxes. It will want to spend money. And so uh, I hesitate to join those who are predicting 20 years inflation at 2% per year. Because the temptation for governments to lay their hands on that money is going to be very hard to resist. Does Mr. Bernanke look pretty good to you? Yes, he looks very good to me. But we'll have to see. You, you must understand that the fundamental problem is that you shouldn't have an institution which depends on whether he's good or not. My first preference would be to abolish the Federal Reserve. Stop the growth of government. Bring government down and make it smaller.